Hi there guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Joanna and today we are doing a 15 minute home dumbbell workout exercise regime. So all you need is a pair of dumbbells that you feel comfortable with. If you haven't got a pair of dumbbells, use some water bottles, fill them up with sand or even water and you can use those instead. So we've got five exercise moves today today and we're gonna repeat those three times. So we've got three rounds of five moves. So that's gonna take us up to a full 15 minutes workout. Make sure you do a warm up before you start this and finish with a cool down. So let's get cracking. We're starting with a squat and a press. So as you're squatting back, weight onto your heels, pushing all the way up, arms come up to the ceiling and back down. This is a squat and press. Here we go, 30 seconds on the clock. Good, and really make sure you're pushing your bottom back, power up through the legs, weight into the heels. I'm using four kilograms in each hand. So as I'm pushing my arms up, I'm working my triceps, also my deltoids. Good, holding your core in nice and strong. Come on, and 30 seconds, breathe it there. You're gonna need a good 30 seconds between each exercise just to get your breath back. Next one, bent over row. Roll the shoulders back, bending forward from the waist, nice flat back, bringing the elbows close into the body and bringing the hands back down, making sure you've got those elbows really close, squeezing between the shoulder blades. Get ready. Here we go. Nice, good, steady move. Squeeze between your shoulder blades as you're coming up. Go on, keep powering it through. If this is feeling easy for you, that's a sign to say that you need to heavy your weights. You need to up your weights, folks. Good, to make those muscles really work. Two seconds. Good, and breather, well done. Next exercise, we're into a side lunge and lateral raise. Now I'm gonna change my weights here. I'm gonna take it down to a three kilogram in each hand. So you're side lunging, coming back, side lunging, and then you're gonna add in a lateral raise. So it looks a little bit like this. Woo. This is a good one for the shoulders. Okay, roll the shoulders back and down. Off we go, 30 seconds on the clock. Go on, you can do this. So these weights should be feeling like you're really working your shoulders, but you're only doing it for 30 seconds. So you can get through this, yeah. Go on, keep it going. Powering up, bring your elbows up to shoulder height if you can. Oh, adding one more. Breather, well done. In for a V-sit. Onto the floor. Good, roll the shoulders back and down. Come into a V position where you're keeping your back straight. You're feeling tension on your core. Tummy muscles in. Pick your weights up. Shoulder press, sorry, <laughs> chest press and back. So you're pressing up with the arms, off we go. So this is using your core muscles and combining another element in for a chest press. Whew. 30 seconds, go on, keep it going. Should be really feeling, keep that back strong. That's it, keep pressing up. Get those triceps and shoulders working. Steady breath. Oh, and breathe, well done. Coming up into a standing position. We're into a lunge back, reverse lunge. Your knee comes to about an inch off the floor and power it back up. Good, nice and easy. Then you're gonna add in a bicep curl as well. Elbows close into the body, bicep curl, and in. Now make sure your weights are feeling good enough for you to do that. Off we go, 30 seconds. Good, keep looking forward. 
Big step back. Should be a lovely, nice right angle with that front knee as it bends. And really dropping that back knee to about an inch off the floor. And breather, super. Right, next one, back to the beginning. I'm gonna swap the weight back into my fours. We're into a squat and press. Squat and press. Okay, just get your breath, 30 seconds. Let's really power this forward through. Good stance. And two, one, squat and press. Good, now my feet are a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. Good, I'm powering up through my arms, getting those triceps working. It's really important to balance your exercise program. So everything we're doing here today, we do triceps and biceps, we're doing back and front and breather. Next one, roll the shoulders back and down, bent over row. Working our back muscles, flat back, pivot from the hips, soft knees, and roll the shoulders back and down, elbows in, and to the front again. So we're squeezing between the shoulder blades as we're coming up, and then lowering the hands back down. Off we go, 30 seconds. You will really need to up your weights with this one. If you can't feel it, don't be afraid to up your weight. It's not gonna make you bigger, it's gonna make you stronger. It's a really common misconception that the heavier the weight you use, the bigger you're gonna get. No, 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 no. You need to get strong. Make sure your shoulders are really back. Good, and breather. Fantastic, I'm gonna swap my weights again into my threes, because I've got little arms. <laughs> and we're into a side lunge, lateral raise. So as you lunge out to the side, you bring up the elbows into shoulder height, back in and over to the other side. Okay, body up tall, we can do this. Second round of side lunges. Two, one, here we go. Good, and power. So we take a nice big stride out. Make sure your knees are not going right over your toes. You need a bigger stride if they are. The lower you go, the more it's gonna work. And you should be really feeling this on your shoulders. Way. Good. One block on the other side and breathe. Well done. Be sit. Second time, be sit. So again, shoulders back, body straight. Take it to where you feel tension and you're using those core muscles. So we don't want to see any arching of the back. You've got to see a nice flat back, pull the tummy muscles in. And then we're powering up for a chest press. Here we go, and up. Oh, I talk too much. That's it. Yeah. If you can, pull your pelvic floor muscles in as well at the same time. Good, keep going. Push up and through. We made it, super stuff. Up for a stand. Back in for a reverse curl, reverse lunging, bicep curl. Reverse lunge, and then gonna add in a bicep curl as well at the same time. Elbows close into the body, but lunging back, curl up, and in. Okay. Five seconds before we start. Roll the shoulders back and down. Off we go. Palms facing forward. You can do alternating if you want to. That's absolutely fine. I'm just keeping it 
dual, doing double to make things nice and simple today. Good. Elbows close in. Nice control, steady movement. Yes, made it. Okay, swap your weights if you need to. Last round. Squat and press. So, into your squats, pressing right up. Make sure you roll those shoulders back and down. Tummy muscles in. Good squats, folks. Don't want to see any lagging on this squat. Really push that bottom out and power up. Here we go. Last one of these to go. Let's make it good set. Go on, keep it going. Oh, and breather. Well done. Next one, bent over row. Feet in a nice comfortable position. Core in. Bend, pivot from the hips. Hands come in front. Roll the shoulders, set the back. Elbows come up, close in and down. When you're coming up, I want you to imagine that you're cracking a nut. Here we go. Crack that nut between the shoulder blades so you're activating your rhomboid muscles. Good, we're doing biceps, upper back, a bit of stability for the lower back here as well. Good. You're over halfway, keep it going. In this exercise. Yes, finish. Right, pop your weights down. Find a lighter pair if you need to. Into V sets. Right. Again, shoulders back. Come back so you can feel the tension in the core muscles here. You're going to place your hands up to shoulder height, push forward into a press and down. So I'm back on my three kilograms, off we go. So I'm going to take it back a little bit more, try and prevent the lower back from arching out. So you've got a, a bit of a decline press going on here. And we're working the core. Oh, this is a toughie. Go on, keep it going. Last one of this. Yes, we did it. Okay, up we come. So into a reverse lunge, bicep curl. Big step back and up. Now let's try adding the curling. Elbows close into the body, shoulders back and down. Curl and up. Curl. And now, easy as that. So we're just going to wait for that bell. Five seconds. Two, one, here we go. Good, take a bigger stride back. Make your body work a little bit more. This is your last exercise today. Nice and controlled movements. 15 minutes. What a nearly, really, really good 15 minutes. And breather. Woo. Good. Well done. You made it through a whole 15 minutes of just doing five exercise moves. Fantastic. If you like what you've just done, please press the like button hit subscribe and tell me what you would like to see in the future. Love to hear from you. Okay, ciao, ciao. Bye.